Hey, say what it do, YouTube. It's your boy, Richard Carter. I am back with another YouTube video. And as you can see by the title, man, we are back with another sneaker review. We are back with some heaters, some bangers. Y'all remember the last pair that I did not too long ago because, you feel me, I wasn't a big fan of these shoes. When they told me that they was going to send me these shoes, I said, ah, I'm not fucking with these shits. It was like giving skateboarder vibes, like, you know what I'm saying, Oasis. And I just wasn't fucking with it. Then I got them. And I went to this baseball game. And I wore them. And the amount of people that was like, yo, Fuck, what are those? Then the way that they look, how you can put them together, the drip combinations, everything like that. People hit me up again and said, hey man, we got another pair that you might want to review. So I said, fuck it, man, send them. So we got another pair right here of the Lavin Paris. Another new pair. These are red and white. Um, These bad boys is fire. These is fire. So what I found out is these are tennis sneakers, which I didn't know. Which is crazy to think about because these bad boys is bulky, but these are tennis shoes. These are tennis shoes. But these are the best tennis shoes that money can buy. So we got a pair of Lavin, Lavin Paris tennis shoes. Um, I like these shoes a lot, man. I'll tell you why. I have a few reasons why I like these shoes. But um, let me give you a full 360 first. So we got the red and white combination. The big bulky red laces, and it got like that light gray clay kind of color to it. The red back tab on the back, same thing on the side with the profile, etc. etc. Let's put this shoe down and let's deep dive into it. Let's talk about it. So, the reason why I like this shoe so much is because, for one, this is a size 12, and you can never tell because of how the shoe is made. The shoe is made to almost make your foot look small, like it doesn't look like a big ass shoe. Compared to a lot of shoes that I do have, this shoe looks really, really small. And I like the bulky look. Like if you wear some skinny jeans, right? You throw on some skinny jeans with this. It like, it doesn't look crazy. Yeah, proportions is important, but it doesn't look crazy because of the way the layout of the shoe is. The shoe doesn't look huge from the side. It doesn't look that big. Look, compared to my head, like we're talking about my head here and it doesn't look huge. My hand, it doesn't look huge. Yes, it's a bulky shoe, but the shoe isn't long. That's what I really do like about them. But let's get into the details about the shoe here. So it's like a wavy look. Um, it's like it's a white and like clay gray type of color on the shoe. And it's just it's just nice. I like the red black lace combination with the white. And then you come to the side right here and it has the logo right here. And you got the back the red tab right here come to the other side similar to the other side of course and then back here this is the inside of the shoe got lavin white sole and then this is the bottom of the shoe it's red it's not much to this shoe but it's really really nice and the reason why i say it's really really nice is because i have another pair that i was talking about to y'all before that i just want to show you this is the first pair that i ever had got and these lavins are so nice bro i just love it especially the all black pair i do like the all black pair rather than that but i wanted a white pair so that hey if i'm wearing a lighter color if i'm doing you know i'm saying some red type of color i can have that i don't really have red shoes in my collection like i look over and the only thing i have is my bread fours and those are black and red so it's still in this black scheme right here so i said you know i want a white and red shoe let me get some lavins um and i got these ones right here but this is the first pair these ones feel amazing i wore them all day had these on for 10 plus hours taking the train come back home etc etc these shoes feel amazing they look good feel good you look good you feel good you play good you know what i'm saying you know the rest but um yeah so definitely some more pairs of lavins in the future for sure but yeah so yeah these are these bad boys right here um not really talk your ear off too much put these bad boys on foot and i will see you over there i'm not gonna lie i didn't know how i was gonna feel with it being on foot and like the the combination of the jeans with the big bulky shoe man i have a mirror right here that i'm looking into right now and this shoe is clean this shoe is just 10 out of 10. Every time I feel like I'm gonna be disappointed by laughing, you throw them on and you forget all about it, bro. Forget all about it, I cannot lie. 
This motherfucker is heat. This shoe is heat, dog. Yo, I'm telling you, 10 out of 10, I have no complaints. The only thing I don't like, like, like about Lavin's is there's another lace that's under the shoe right here. She has white lace that also like is another lace that you have to try to hide. And right now I have it tucked in on this shoe and this shoe I properly tied it. Besides that, 10 out of 10. Dude, what do I have to say? Y'all see it. I love the, the big ropey look, shoe lace, jumbo lace. I love the fact that it hangs. I love the the droopy effect to it. I love the loose look. It looks so clean. Look at this shoe, man. Come on. Yo. Seriously. 10 out of 10. No complaints. Just enjoy the view, man. Seriously. Go copy up here. All the information will be in the description down below. Need I say any more? For real. Do I have to? If this ain't sell you on a shoe, then I don't know what will. Seriously. Clean. Fucking clean.